was a dream nearly 30 years in the making and now come true for the next sheriff of Clark County. Christopher Clark worked his way up through the ranks at the sheriff's office. He says that he plans to use those years of experience to implement some big changes. New at 5, 2 News reporter Leah Seabrooks is in Springfield after talking to the incoming sheriff about his victory and what he plans to change. After starting as a dispatcher in 1997, Christopher Clark will be the next sheriff of Clark County as he will run unopposed in the upcoming November election. In 97, I never would have imagined that uh, I'd be sitting here today. In the March primary election, Clark unseated current Clark County Sheriff Deb Burchett. Clark was born and raised in the county, something he says played a major role in his grassroots campaign approach. Clark won the Republican sheriff nomination by nearly 3,100 votes, almost 20 percent more than Burchett. One of Clark's biggest concerns is mandated overtime for deputies. He says this is a side effect of low staffing at the agency. Clark says the fee to apply for jobs in the sheriff's office has been a barrier for qualified applicants. Staffing problems breed more staffing problems. People get burnt out, they get tired, they get sick. So they call in, so now you have to have more staffing to cover that person who got sick. The sheriff's office reported overtime expenditures above $1 million last year. Clark says this is also attributed to outdated COVID safety policies still in place at the jail. Arresting officers cannot enter the jail, sometimes for hours, while waiting for their prisoners to be booked. That's, that's hours and, and time taken off the street where these officers should be out. Uh, protecting the citizens of Clark County. Clark wants to incorporate trainings for deputies to better respond to new age drug trafficking. Through his narcotics enforcement experience, he says it is vital to invest in furthering this education for deputies. After 26 years with the agency, Clark says he is fully committed to continue improving operations at the sheriff's office once he officially begins his new role. You know, and I want to make sure that I provide the best safe environment for my family and the family of, of every every person who lives here in the county. Clark will be sworn into office on January 6th of 2025. In Springfield, Aaliyah C. Brooks, 2 News.